of YouTube, it's Theme Park Baza with This is Baza And today join us, we are on International Drive And why are we on International Drive? Well here's another viewer's request um, If you wanted to go and buy Walt Disney merch You really only had a couple of options didn't you? There yeah. was Downtown Disney, sorry Disney Springs Disney Springs Go to a park yeah. Or go to a Disney hotel And see what they have But that didn't work for a lot of people who were maybe up in the International Drive area Who didn't have a car who were trying to commute. So about the wind, it's um, there's a storm coming, and couldn't commute anywhere. So um, what Disney have done is open a Walt Disney World store here on International Drive. And somebody said, "Hey Barry, can you and Maxine go and film that?" So we're here to do that today. We'll show you exactly where it is. I'm just going to walk down onto our drive. We'll show you where it is. So we're just going to walk down to uh, down the steps onto International Drive. Show you where it is. Um, the traffic lights there is on Sand Lake, so the world biggest McDonald's is there. The um, you got to cross from BJ's, you can see Icon Park here, and this is next to the big blue hotel or whatever it was, bar, restaurant, whatever that place is called. Is it Mangoes? Mangoes, I think it's called Mangoes. Over there is the hotel that Jade stayed at, a uh, girl up north. It's Jade and Kev, it's the Wyndham. Yeah. So if you want to see what that was like, go check out their vlogs. And over here behind us is the Walt Disney World store. So this is where it is, just between Sand Lake and International Drive. Just here on the right, we'll take you inside, show you what there is. And out of interest, what we didn't know is if you just take the turning down here, there is, oh, and you can see where these cars are coming out actually, there's a golden coral down there, which we didn't know about. Yeah. By the way, this parking lot that this is underneath is closed. So you can't park in here. You're gonna have to pick one of these spaces around at the moment as we record this at the end of June. So. We're going to go inside. I think there's a storm coming. Storm. So we're going to go inside. It's Florida. Yeah. It's three o'clock. And we're going to film and see what we can find inside of um, the Walt Disney World store. Yep. Yeah. And it's open. The store is open Monday to Friday, 11 till 7, and same at the weekends, 11 till 7. Hello. Good, how are you? Oh, they have some 50th merch here. They do have 50th merch. For your top. They have your top. Oh, they got, oh, that's the monorail. That's not the one we got, is it? It's not the train set we got. How much is that? How much that is? Oh, it's Looks like they also have a ticket centre here, so if you need to get your tickets, you can get those here as well. That's a good idea. That's my shirt, Max. It's only a small store, isn't it? I wonder if we can get our, um, if we have to do anything with our passes renewing here. Like what? Do we need to just ask? I'll get on to that sec. So we just got ours renewed, didn't we, Max? We did. So this has been, the whole thing's been here about three weeks, but that was handy. We just, um, we got annual passes, um, resident annual passes, and we would have had to go to Springs, or as we said, to the parks to get it, but we got them here, didn't we? Yeah, same as the trip. Yeah, handy to know. Look at that, Max. It's like the figment one, isn't it? It's supposed, yes. to go, it's supposed to go on your bed at okay. night. So they got mini as well, I think. Yeah, oh yeah. How much are they? 35 bucks. Yeah. Stitch. Stitch. So it is only a very small so it's not bigger than you would find in a um, theme park store, is it? Like in a in a hotel. No. Got your little uh, Oh look at these Max. Max, how much are these Plutos? About yeah, if, if you want to know how much these are, go, go check out the Kershaw's for all these birthday because I'm pretty sure he got one of these for five dollars. Though strange here, how much are they saying they are here? Saying the 29.99. 29.99, yeah. I don't know how Gaz got it for five dollars, but he was amazing. Got your ears? Oh, they have some lunch fly, yeah. Oh, and they do have um a DVC Grand Vacations Club automated terminal here so you can basically go in and you can um, you can watch a video you can look at photos you can virtual room tours so if you want to come in here and see what it's like in a specific hotel so we want to do Grand Floridian one bedroom Grand Villa this is what Pete and Pippa had I think what it actually does is give you a virtual tour but actually oh wow that's cool we're seeing it here on the big screen as well so 
you can actually walk around. Like you're physically there? Yeah, like, I wonder if you can go out on the balcony. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, look. That's pretty cool, isn't it? You see, all I'm doing here is just an iPad type thing, so I'm, I'm just moving it around with my finger. And then I... Ooh. And then if you want to go back, come back. So you can pick um, a different resort. These are the 360, so I guess um, they've only got the Grand Floridian. It's only the villas at Grand Floridian looking at this. Let's go back to main menu. Back to all resorts. And you can see which ones you want. You can go to um, Animal Kingdom. And, oh, there isn't an Animal Kingdom 360. I should say Animal Kingdom. It's the, what do you call it, isn't it? It's the... Um, so you can do Riviera 360. You can look at a deluxe studio. And uh, here you go. Look in the bathroom. Swing around. Oh, door's shut. It's not going to let me go outside because the door's shut. But yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it? Cool. It's only like a virtual thing, but it's uh, pretty cool. I just felt back, so if anybody else comes, they've got it at the main menu. Not left halfway through. And then, of course, you've got just a very small selection of all your different uh, princesses, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars. Very limited. I thought it'd be bigger, actually. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's better than nothing, especially having that ticket centre here, yeah. where you can go and organise. If you haven't bought tickets That's when you come, the best thing here. yeah, you can't be buying tickets when you come, um, or getting your passes or all that kind of stuff, organising your your, your evening events or whatever, Got Marvel stuff. Well, those are strollers at the same price as they were in the hotel, thirty nine, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they are 40 bucks for a Disney one. Yeah. So is this like the cup I was trying to drink out of before? That yeah, big one? But it's a jug. It's a jug. So that's my milk for my coffee. Well, there's a cup. Oh no, it's a milk. Well, it's just a Get your, your Trabant things there. That's the newer one. Is that the newer one? It's what you've got. That's what I've got. What do they call it Trabant? I always forget the name. Trabant's a car from Russia. Tribut, Tribut yeah. Well, that's what we call them. I don't know what I'm doing. Coffee, popcorn, and your cups. The pigment cup. Pigment, 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 pigment. Don't you there? Yeah, twenty-five dollars. Got your things again. Your uh, your bath. Oh yeah, I did it across in the bottom, I didn't see them across there, did I? No, matching to the... whichever... Oh, whichever, whichever theme they're on, yeah. yeah. They got some uh, purses and little bags. Backpacks, how much are the backpacks, the Walt Disney World? Uh, it's not bad, for, for a Disney World. Didn't you have a hat like that once, Max? Uh, no. no? I thought the kids had one, maybe Chloe did. Chloe probably Got some more 50th here. Pens again. Yeah. You saw in the hotel the other week. No, these were the Were they? How much are they? Eight, Eight dollars. Yeah. yeah. The what? Well, the, the top you like. Spirit shirt. How much are those? No prices on.
Oh, the oh yeah, yeah, in the 50s costumes. Costumes, yeah. again. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 And they got the game up. Oh. So <laughs> that is so cute. How much are they? 20 bucks? Or is that for that one on top? 99. Yeah. Good. I think they did a Hungry Hippos Jungle Cruise one. <laughs> theme park edition, did you? I think we got that one. Oh, they've got the... Um... Yeah, the swelling sauces. It's cool. You put ribbon on it and hang it on the tree. That's how it is. No, oh no, you would do <laughs> though, you would do, yeah. I would change it. Yeah, you put ribbon on it. Yeah, see? Oh, look, like Small World. No. No. And Jungle Cruise. I think there's a Clue Villains one as well, though, like a uh, Cluedo. <laughs> it's only like tweaked to. And even in Perfection, they've got all the, um, you know, Tara Tara, Dumbo, all the rides, like things that jump out. And the tram. Oh, yeah. Which are almost running back at all the parks again. Parking lot tram. They were the only ones you'd be able to... Yeah, I don't think we've been on a tram yet, have we, since they've no. come back up. Monsters Universe, Thomas Kincaid uh, jigsaws. Those are the things, those pencil case things we saw in the uh, Grand Floridian the other week. And the cups. Enjoy. 13 bucks for the cups. And joining, it's got the yeah, Mickey on the other side, or the hidden Mickey on the other side. Not really hidden, it's just there. What's that? Something that I have. What does that say? Any, anybody got any clues what that is? Phone holder? A what holder? Phone holder. Phone holder. So why would you have that there? Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to ask this lady. Yeah. Comments below, see if you get it right. Max is going to ask what it is. You go for three. Write your comments now. Three, two, one. And then we'll see what she says when she gets back here. Okay, Max. Really Do they not? He says you can put pens in and put a book on. Right, okay. Well, put your suggestions below. What Max thinks you could put a mobile phone in there. You could actually maybe, like, put a power leak, drill it and put a... I don't know, care. No, you can't put the cable, no, it's just going to go to the bottom, through, hasn't it? Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Suggestions below, what do you think they should be used for? Nice suggestions, no rude ones. Have you ever seen them before? No, I haven't. Have you seen the mirror? Oh no, they're just for mirrors. These, this is what Pippa could do with for storing all her ears, couldn't it? Yeah. Like, you can try them on and you can see yourself what you look like in them. Yeah, I don't sell them though. Uh, we can sneak one out, can't we? <laughs> put it under you. Oh no, they're screwed down. Oh, well, sorry, Pippa. And then these are the jars, yeah, these, these are the ones like it up, can not So, that's a bigger one that's been that you liked. Got yeah. it then? So we're back out after about 10 minutes. It's not a big store, no, as you saw. It's only a small store. It's but... only been over three weeks, but I mean, having that guest relations there, I think is a big deal. Cause as she was saying when we were, to sorry, he was saying, we were talking to him, it'll save you going down to Disney Springs to get anything done with your passes mm. or the evening dues at the merch, meh. You know, I still think you're better going to the character outlet for merch wise. Yeah. Um, but if you're interested in DVC and you've got questions, this may be a place to come. If you're interested in getting something done around you, as you say, your passes around that area, that's, Good place to come. Mm -hmm. And um, I don't know about you, Mrs. Theme Park Buzz, but I'm feeling a bit peckish now. Peckish. Shall we go find somewhere to eat, eat on International Drive? Or cocktail time? Could be tempted. Let's go. So we haven't driven far, have we? No. So that's where we were. And this is the um, world's biggest, or was the world's biggest McDonald's. And we've come to Perkins, that's just here on the corner. I don't know if we've ever been to a Perkins. I we might have done it in the past, I'm not sure. No, I don't want kids all out. Yeah. I know a few of you have asked about places to go and eat, so this is right on iDrive. Um, it's open all day. I seem to have came here a long time ago in the past. We're going to go and have brunch here, uh, see what it's like. So there you go. Sand Lake, International Drive, Perkins. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, so we're sat down. Just waiting for our table. 20 minutes. Yeah, just notice you can buy all the 
the uh, pies and the cakes that and they have. Yeah, I don't think this yeah. place has been decorated since 1980. No. So this kind of old school in here as well, isn't it, Max? Yeah. Very 1990s diner. Lots of dark wood. So look at the menu. We got breakfast stuff. We have more breakfast stuff. We have burgers. Build your own breakfasts. Salads. And then you've got your average room. I, I saw this and thought, oh, pint and a pint and a pie. Beverage and a pie, no, but it's a it's a thingy pie. What do you call it? A fruit pie. Fruit pie. And a, and a drink. You can have salmon like we had for tea last night. You got pot roast. I don't see chicken, Max. I don't see chicken. Really. It's a fried chicken somewhere. Oh, 55 plus menu. There you go. I can get that. You can get that. What do you mind your mic? Four man's Denny's. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, the food might be good though. Don't judge a book by its cover. You married me? <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with the builder breakfast for me. You can pick one of each. And then I might get I might be cheeky and get bacon and get sausage as well. And crispy hash browns and then um, get the biscuits or the pancakes, I'm not sure. Or toast, I might just get toast. Who are you gonna go for? I think I'm gonna go with the double catch. So our serve is good because um, she's running around, but she's a bit overwhelmed. Lots of tables. What do you think it's going to be like, Max? It's either going to be really, really good, or it's going to be really, really bad. Yep. Yeah. Well, one extreme to the other. We'll see. Mine was about ten bucks. How much was yours? Uh, about no, a bit more. I think it's about eleven or twelve. Okay. Stand by. We'll give you an update. What did you get, Max? Fish and chips. Fish and chips, basically. Do you know? Didn't know his fish and chips was getting, and I got the breakfast as we said with the bacon, sausage, egg, hash browns, and toast. Didn't know you were getting fish and chips though. Well, fish, chips, and shrimp. No, oh, okay. shrimp, okay. Fish, chips, and shrimp, okay. Enjoy. The sausage is really different. It's like, a, it's like a Canadian bacon. It's like, what do you call it? Polish mm. sausage. Yeah. Got me fork stuck now. Yeah. It's okay. It's not red hot. It's warm. It's not red hot. How's yours? It's alright. Yeah. So you have fish and chips. Yeah. So here's the um, here's the check at the end. It was um, 9.29 for yours, yeah. 9.59 for mine. I paid for the extra bacon, two sodas, six bucks. So the total came to 27.88. And, and Wendy was amazing, wasn't she? Our server. Yeah. She thought because of the action, she thought we were tourists, and every yeah. time she's getting us drinks, she's going like, it's free refills, it's free refills. <laughs> then she gave me a, a takeout with a lid on. She goes, and that's where you put the straw in. <laughs> like. We didn't say anything, we just smiled at Wendy, but it was really, uh, really quaint. Yeah. So she's really good, we had a chat with Wendy. Um, uh, she was good. So what do you think, Max? It was okay, pretty basic food, but if you want to fill your boots. Yeah, that's the thing, I mean, it wasn't, you know, it didn't blow you away, but if you're bringing a family here, don't, you know, just expect a 1980s interior. Yeah, it's a bit old interior. Yeah, it's a bit, it's like Wendy's was 20 years ago, not Wendy's, um, Denny's. Denny's was 20 years ago, so they haven't really updated the interior, but the food came out quickly. Yeah, it it wasn't piping hot, but I mean it was, was warm, um, and they were—they weren't, you know—they were cranking it out, weren't they? So um, we put your tip on the table, and we're going to pay with check. Uh, she says if you put it on the card, it takes her a week to get the money. So if you got cash, put it on the table on the way out. So um, yeah, I would say if you're bringing a Perkins, this was again this one, one we've been to. I think the other one's the bottom end of International Ground. Um, yeah. You know, it's okay. Uh, you said the that t that tasted a bit uh, like the oil wasn't fresh. Yeah, the oil was a little bit old. Yeah. You know, just get that taste. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't bad. You could still eat it. I could still eat it. Yeah. But it was just there in the background. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. Yeah. Bear that in mind. And and if you're having a breakfast, they can't really do it wrong. And I really like that sausage. Yeah. Like I think a Polish it, I sausage. Think it's probably better. It's for a good breakfast, breakfast place. Yeah, I would say. Yeah. I would, I I would, yeah, but you know, that'd be our our, our recommendation. That anyway. yeah. So give it a try. Don't judge a book by its cover. You never know. We might just wait a minute before we uh, head out. So we're back. As you can hear, the water's dripping. The, we got a bit wet on the way back, didn't we? We did. It did rain, but we're now back and the car is plugged in. So yeah, just to wrap up there, um, one thing um, I did notice when we got back on the menu, it's called the Perkins Restaurant and Bakery. Mm -hmm. And I'll put a clip in here of all the pies. I mean, Maxim went and talked about it earlier on. We didn't really show, but there's a lot of pies there, they weren't look there? good and all. And you could buy the pies whole, mm -hmm. or you could buy um, slices of the pie. And like you saw on that menu, they did offer um, like a drink and a slice of pie. And you saw people just coming in for that, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I'm sure there was a couple next door, but while on the table. Yeah, I had that. And uh, we did get a secret tip from somebody that if you're going there on a Monday evening, 
there may be opportunities to get some uh, free, free pie. pie. And the other thing you should mention as well, if you come in here on holiday, is check the websites out, register with their loyalty programs or whatever, mm -hmm. and you can get discounts and vouchers. And again, don't forget to call into places like hotel lobbies. We got vouchers the other day, I forget, where did we get them from? We got them at Golden Corral. Golden Corral, yeah. Just walk through the door, they have things there, and they use Perkins as one of those, they usually have discounts. Yeah, so it was like the Red Lobster, no, the Lobster Fest. Lobster Fest. Yeah, and, and Mini Golf. Yep. Uh, usually has discounts on there as well. So don't forget that if you're coming here, maximize your money, because it's not cheap now. So you can get deals. And so yeah, you know, it was um, it was a good day today. Mm. As I say, we um, showed you the new Disney store, we um, showed you Perkins. Yeah. And again, there's a few like that, a few different chains you can go to. Landry's the other way, you can get Landry cards as well. They'll give you discounts on certain things, aren't they? Yeah, that is a little bit more expensive yeah. though, all the Landry ones. Right? Yeah, yeah, they're more expensive for restaurants. Yeah. Ones. But like we said, for breakfast, that's not a bad place to go. Yeah, go back for breakfast yep. again, I think. Yep. So thanks for watching today. Um, we hope you enjoyed today's vlog. If you like what we do, please like and subscribe. It does help the channel. Put your comments below. We try and respond to your comments. And we will see the latter. Bye. Bye.